Boeing is ending the company's turbulent year with more big changes. Today, the aircraft producer firing its CEO. ABC's Elena Gomez has more. Another week, another shakeup at Boeing. The company's former CEO, Dennis Muhlenberg, forced out after 35 years with the company and four years as CEO. The company stating in part that the board of directors made the change, quote, to restore confidence in the company moving forward as it works to repair relationships with regulators, customers, and all other stakeholders. Have to work on the software to get it to be fully representative of the airplane over time. This is video from October when former CEO Dennis Muhlenberg spoke before the House Transportation Committee about the safety of Boeing 737 MAX, citing a problem with the flight control software system. An investigation will determine if the system error caused the two Boeing plane crashes in Ethiopia and Indonesia. But no number other than zero accidents is ever acceptable. We can and must do better. We've been challenged and changed by these accidents. Just last week, Boeing made another big announcement, temporarily shutting down production on their 737 MAX planes in January. The aircraft company saying they wouldn't lay off their thousands of workers, instead keeping them on 737 work or assigning them to other projects. Employees were still nervous of the change. I just hope it's short, and I hope that uh, we get the planes flying again. For now, Boeing says they are taking steps to get the company, quote, on the right path for a strong future. Dave Calhoun, a chairman of the Boeing board, will become the company's new CEO on January 13th. Alana Gomez, ABC News, Los Angeles.